in today's <coughs> short episode about Social Media 101, I was reading uh, some articles through my Google News Feed, and this one post came up, and it reminded me of how when you're going through social media, you'll either encounter a lot of clickbait or poorly written articles. You could, This might not be considered a poorly written article, but based on my mathematics, it, it doesn't really make sense. This was about... Uh, some, I think, some international person from Fandom Wire wrote in a social media post, The Rock Faces Major Humiliation is 10-year-old Hugh Jackman movie Prisoners Annihilates Black Adam with 14.2 million hours viewed. Now, first of all, these statistics are done through a third party, not through the actual company itself. So one has to understand or... You don't have to make people understand because it's easy to write an article like this and say that, what do you call it, this prisoner movie is just killing uh, uh, a new movie by by uh, The Rock. But in, in fact, when you actually look at it, it's a lot of misinformation. So to me, this might be considered an, an example of clickbait or poorly written article. One is uh, to consider is both of these movies are being uh, displayed through or published through two different platforms. Uh, I, th I believe uh, The Prisoner with Hugh Jackman is done through Netflix. And you can see I found an article that found how many subscribers there are in North America, 74 million about. And then when we look at Black Adam, his movie is just through HBO Max. And this is an older article in April 2022, but I can't see it changing much. So around 48.6 million in the U.S. So we're, we're talking about the numbers aren't the same. We're talking about maybe it could possibly be double the amount of n number of people using Netflix versus HBO. And now you're comparing hours viewed based on this so i mean if the rocks movie black adam was on netflix then in theory this number of hours viewed like 10.2 million or something should be what do you call it double maybe it could be 20 million uh viewed in in North America feels on Netflix. So that's the kind of things where you make it seem like it's a big difference when it's not really when you have to consider what platform it's being displayed on and how many users it's being displayed for. So again, that's one one thing. The other thing is these numbers aren't actual the true numbers that you can find. This is all data that's accumulated by third party tracker Nielsen. So you take that with a grain of salt. I mean, their numbers aren't exact. They're tracking things and then extrapolating and then saying, oh, this is how many million hours viewed. And so, again, I just want to make this short post about how social media can put things out there and it doesn't have all the information out there. It makes it seem that, yeah, Rock, The Rock's new movie, Black Adam, is getting killed. Uh, in, in streaming, but really, when you have a when you're put on a streaming platform that has less subscribers, of course you're going to have less views, less viewing hours. So it's just again, you have to be careful of clickbait or poorly written articles on social media, and it's tough because social media isn't based on facts. It's actually just based on you know entertaining people with media. So that was an article I saw today over and out.